What's up guys, I'm Xavier Elon. I do hacker rank lead code and coding tutorials. So please subscribe to my channel and check me out if you haven't already. Also a like on this video would help me immensely. Um, today I'm going over remove duplicates from sorted list. So this is a pretty simple problem. We just have to remove um, duplicates so that each element appears only once. So this is key right here. Yeah, the element still has to appear at least once. So we just remove this one, um, this one, and this three. So, um, I wrote it over to, uh, I guess, edge test case. So if there's um, three ones, we I should have, it's going to, we're going to want to return um, one and three. So that's what we're going to want to return. So, um, so let's just jump right to this. How would we solve this? We're just going to, um, well, we're going to want to return head at the end since head is the pointer. So let's create a list node, um, call it current, and set it equal to head. So this is what we'll edit. Um, and then we'll just loop through the linked list. So while current does not equal null. And since we're going to be um, looping through the list, uh, we want to make sure that current dot next does not equal null because if current dot next does equal null and we don't have that in there um, we'll get an out of bounds pointer problem in Java at least um, so um, <clears throat> so then we're going to check if current dot val so we got to check for the value equals current dot next dot val then current dot next equals current dot next dot next. So that's basically saying, so if this is current, um, this is current dot next. So if these two are equal, it's saying uh, set current dot next equal to this. So it's basically removing this one, which is exactly what we wanted to do. Um, so else, else uh, current equals current dot next. So let me explain this. Um, you have to put it in an else statement because we've the, we have to m account for multiple, um, it could be multiple duplicates, not just one, like this kind of makes it seem like. So um, this makes this while loop kind of, the else executes only when um, the val does not equal, the vowels aren't the same. So um, if we go through this, let me scoot this over. So we have current here, current, current dot next. Well, these two are the same. So um, as you can see right here, so we're gonna put, move this over to here. So this basically removes this. So now this is current dot next. And then it checks, so we don't execute current equals current dot next because uh, this executed. Uh, that's why it's important to have the else in there. And then, <clears throat> so we checked again. Um, they're still the same. So it, it moves this one over to here. So it basically removes this. So now this is current dot next. And then, so this doesn't execute again, but now um, current dot next is uh, still not null. So we check one more time. Um, in this case, we execute the else statement and current equals current dot. So then we increment it. Um, and then head still pointing to the beginning of the list. So that's what we return at the end. And this should work. Hopefully in the first try, I didn't make any silly mistakes. All right, and that's it. Thanks for watching. This, so this is just O of N runtime. Um, I believe it's O of one space complexity because we're just creating a new node. Yeah. So, um, thanks for watching guys.